Police are trying to figure out who stole money from St. Paul Cathedral. They say someone took the money out of the boxes meant for prayer candles. Paul Martino has reaction from parishioners. St. Paul's Gothic structure towers over the Oakland neighborhood. It is the mother church of the Pittsburgh Catholic Diocese. And at Wednesday's noon mass, parishioners were just learning that cash from the votive boxes had been stolen. That's really just a horrible thing to do. Probably someone looking for an easy way to find some money. That's too bad. That's a shame. That's sad. And it's sad for parishioners who want to make that special prayer for themselves or others. Because right now, there are no votive candles at St. Paul Cathedral. The box that holds donations is badly damaged and being repaired. I hope it doesn't stop them from keeping votive candles because I wanted to light one, but there's none there. A really sad thing, especially whenever you consider what those candles are and mean. It's a representation of people's prayers and their intentions that they light and really as an offering to God. It's believed the two burglars were involved. They hid inside the church, and following Saturday evening mass, they pried open the cash box and fled. For now, the church is willing to forgive and to help the burglars. To come and to apologize, not just to the church, but to those people and to, to come clean. It's really a, that reconciliation that brings peace. For now, parishioners appear willing to turn the other cheek, but they're hoping that next time, the thieves will seek the spiritual guidance of the church and not steal from the church. In Oakland, Paul Martino, KDKA News.